Yesterday, Hasbro announced its 2023 earnings, and it was pretty rough. Overall, Hasbro's revenue was down 15% on the year, and this is despite the fact that Wizards' revenue actually grew by 10%. The one brightest spot for Hasbro was Universes Beyond Lord of the Rings, which is already the best-selling magic set of all time. Thanks to its success, Hasbro was doubling down on Universes Beyond, literally. Starting next year, there'll be two temple Lord of the Rings-style Universes Beyond sets each year, which means one magic theme set will be knocked off the schedule in favor of another set featuring Final Fantasy, Marvel, or whatever other unannounced IP comes next. Whether this is good or bad remains to be seen. The crossovers could bring in many new players and lead to a new golden age for the game, or they could push away current players frustrated by the new direction, or maybe even both. So what do you think? Are you hyped for even more universes beyond, or sad to see magic's own IP being minimized? Let me know in the comments.